Hi everybody, welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids, a super cute beauty video coming your way. Here it is, the first little beauty goodie we're going to be looking at. I actually picked this up at Claire's on my last trip there. I forgot to put it in the Claire's haul. So here we go. It is this pretty case. It's got all these different makeups. Kind of looks like a palette. There's eyeshadows, tons of sparkly lip glosses. Looks like we get two blushers, little accessories, nail polishes, and this is probably like a body glitter. This next one, oh, I fell in love with it. I love anything Minnie Mouse, Mickey Mouse, Disney. So cute. It is the Minnie Mouse Kiss It Paint It set. It's got some nail polish, lip gloss, this cute little case, and it has Minnie and Daisy on there. Woo, cannot wait to open it. This next little beauty find, ooh, you are gonna love it. Look at it, it is the Beanie Boos Collection Nail Art Kit. How funny is that? It's got all of those little nail polishes, glitter dust, and it's right inside of the Beanie's belly. Cutest packaging ever. And of course, because you know I love my shop geese, we have the Happy Places box and a throwback season two basket. Time to kick off the beauty fun with this Claire's makeup case. Now this case has so much stuff in here. I forget how much it was. Ooh, it was $14.99. That's a pretty good deal because Claire's can be kind of pricey and I think this is a lot of makeup. So we get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 different eyeshadows. They're pretty much every color of the rainbow. We get the glosses, blushers, nail polish. This looks like a body glitter. I love this little hot pink candle. Such a cute gift to give to a friend. Let's open it up. Oops. Here we go. It's so, so colorful. Here it is. The palette is open. It's kind of like a makeup briefcase. Such a cute little carrying case. Here's all the colors. So much makeup going on in here. Time to test it. This set really is amazing just because it comes with everything you need. You get the eyeshadows. Cannot wait to see how those look. Oh, look at that. That looks like lipstick. Look at that color. Woo! We get the sparkle blue. These are so shimmery, filled with pigment. I am just really shocked how nice they are. And you can tell they're really good because they feel silky. When the eyeshadow is not good, it's really powdery and chalky. But this feels like silk. Let me just swatch them. Ooh, look at that light blue. Almost like a silver blue. Reminds me of Elsa. <laughs> That's the color she would wear. We get this kind of metallic purple. A darker blue. Love those. We also get some lighter colors. I am loving this yellow. I have a lot of eyeshadows that are really bright, but this is kind of like a golden one. Oh, so nice. I would almost call that just gold. We get this minty green. <laughs> I've been doing a lot of eyeshadow videos lately. I could just literally do these all day. I love swatching the colors. I love wearing eyeshadow. I wear it every single day. Here is like this icy white color. Really pretty too. That's a nice neutral. Moving on to this other side here that has completely different colors. Ooh, look at this orange. It doesn't look too, too dark. Ooh, I like it. Not something I would wear all the time, but it's definitely a nice shade. This, these three actually, they look like the colors I wear every single day. They're just kind of light, more natural. This is like a champagne pink color. Ooh, that's really nice. One thing I've realized over the years, an eyeshadow doesn't have to be like a super dark color to be pretty on your eye. It still shows up, even if it's light and shimmery. Sometimes those ones even look better. Ooh, yeah, that's really nice. It's kind of like a shimmery lavender, really light. This middle one here, kind of like a pearly pink, almost like a mother of pearl. These are all so pigmented, so, so different. <laughs> I could really stay here all day and look at this. Look at this one, it's kind of like a red. You usually don't see this in a shadow palette. Woo! I don't know about that one. Maybe for like Halloween makeup or something, I couldn't see myself wearing it. But on the skin, it really does look beautiful. We get a couple pinks here. This one is like a little darker. Ooh, I like that. That would be a perfect lip gloss color. So, so pretty. 
And you get a purple here. We get four different shades of purple in this palette. That one is a little lighter than the pink. So look at all of these. You probably have, well, you have 18 different shades. Some of them are almost the same, but most of them are really different. And after testing out all of these eyeshadows, I would have to say my absolute favorite color is this one here. It's really, really pretty. It's like a minty green. So, so nice. You could wear it in the winter, summer. Such a shimmery color to it. And my second favorite is this pink one. <laughs> Even though I would rarely wear it, it is just so nice. And if you had pink lips, they would go together so, so good. So we looked at all the shadows. Now we have four of these really shimmery glosses. I doubt they give color. Ooh, actually it does give a little bit of color. Oh no, it's clear. I think that was the eyeshadow on my hand. But they are so thick, really shimmery, iridescent. Here's like a pink one. A little bit of a pink tint you would get. Let me try the darker pink. It's almost like a cherry red color. Oh yeah, <laughs> that one definitely would give you color. I love that. And that would go really good with this pink shadow. They're almost the same color, or this one's a little darker. It's a close up of the four shimmer glosses. I made a super mess with my fingers, but of course this comes with a handy dandy little lip gloss brush for applicating. And it goes right in the case. Right here in the corner, now this could either be like a body glitter or a super sparkly lip gloss. Ooh, it is body glitter, so, so pretty. Woof, look at that color. Oh, smells good too, smells like strawberries. That would give you so much shimmer. This is great if you're going to like a birthday party and you want to be all makeup and dazzled up or if you're having like a gymnastics competition, you could put a little on your cheekbones. You can even scatter a little bit of this in your hair <laughs> to make your hair twinkle like the gymnasts do. Love it, smells so good. Over here, we get the eyeshadow applicator. Kind of weird, it only comes with one. We should get a few of these just because there's 18 different shades. And we get this little blusher brush, so convenient for the two blushes. Now let's take a look at these. What are they gonna look like? Ooh, they're very subtle, but very pretty. Ooh, I am loving this one. Look at all the shimmer in that. You can even use it as an eyeshadow. You can kind of match your blush and eye together. It's almost like a pinkish coral, lots of shimmer. Here's the two blush colors. We get like a peachy coral and this dusty rose pink. I don't like the pink one too much. I think it's kind of chalky and dry, but this one is just so smooth. It blends right into your skin. It's the best one. Final two accessories. This kit just keeps going and going for 15 bucks. I think it's well worth it. These eyeshadows are pretty big. They'll last you for a long time. And I don't think you're gonna wear these every day. Probably just like on the weekend. You get two nail polishes. Woo! Everything is covered. The nails, the eyes, the lips, body glitter. Oh, look at these cute little bottles. You guys, I made a little boo-boo. <laughs> I thought these were nail polishes. Now when you look at these, what else would they be? But when you open them, this is so cool. They are little mini lip glosses. How funny is that? I've never seen a lip gloss in a little tube like this. Fooled me. <laughs> and actually, to tell you the truth, I was hoping for some nail polish, but I just love these little bottles. So we get this kind of clear sparkly pink. Like we needed more gloss, there's so much in here. These two little things have to be the most clever makeup accessories ever. They look like nail polishes, but they're lip glosses. <gasps> that is just genius. After testing this out, I have had about 20 different Claire's palettes. I think this is probably up there in the top five. So many different shades, had the cutest little lip gloss nail polish bottles. Loved it! On to the next. Beanie Boos! Oh, this is the cutest little package everywhere. It looks like a furry little Beanie Boo. 
and it is the nail art kit. I just went crazy when I saw this. I think I found it at five below. It was five bucks and I just had to have it. I have the T.Y. Little Beanie Boo's lip glosses and now they're making the nail polish. Let's open it. I'm also loving these because they have a little Beanie Boo's logo on there which makes it kind of different and cute. Next nail accessory up is the manicure sponge to separate your little toesies and fingers when you're painting. We get this little sheet of Beanie Boo's nail decals. These are so cute. That's a little owl that was on the package. Hearts, so pretty against these light colors. They're too much. Last but not least, we get this little glitter jar to make the nails sparkle. Ooh, this is beautiful. <laughs> and I love this glitter because it's not super dark. You are gonna see through. So if you just put a little bit, kind of looks like sprinkles onto this polish, you're gonna see both the glitter color and the polish color. Here's all the pieces to that set together. What do you see? We test out these colors and sprinkle a little glitter on there. First one up, we're going with the baby pink. And one thing that I don't like about this kit is these bottles can be just a little bit bigger. They're kind of teeny. Ooh, that's really pretty. So there's your baby pink, almost like a bubblegum pink. We get this minty green turquoise. is a little more than the pink but it would be so cute to wear all these colors at the same time just like I'm doing now with the pinks and purples. It would look really cute for going back to school and we get this darker one almost like a neon. Those colors blend so good together. Of course you can wear your nails plain like this or you could sprinkle a little glitter and have them sparkling. Here they are, those three Beanie Boos colors, light pink, dark pink, and this bluish green in the middle. I am loving all of them just the same, and they have glitter, and they look even cuter with these little owly decals. We still have the mini beauty set to open, but what do you guys see? We take a beauty break to some Shopkins. We have a throwback season two. These are kind of hard to find, but I had a couple saved, and a happy places. Let's open it up. Nothing better than makeup and Shopkins. <laughs> My favorite thing. Here is our delivery box. Our tile. Blind bag. And collector's bag. Okay. Ooh, this one's big. Let's start with this one. These are usually super tiny. This one is huge. Oh, how funny. You know what? I actually have this. I think it's in like pink and white. It's like a little makeup caboodle. It opens. Found it! Here's the one I found yesterday and the one I got today. Ooh, I didn't know there were different colors of these. Different kinds of color schemes going on. I think I like the blue one better. It's a little bit brighter. Oh, it's got little bear ears. Second one up in the middle. Ooh, that's got a lipstick. I wonder if it's in here this time. Oh, how precious! Little itsy bitsy hairbrush. And the final one, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be... Ooh, it's different. Last time we got a mirror. This time there's this adorable little hat. It's got a rose on it. Coming in from the Dreamy Bear department, we have Makeup Box brush. Oh, a little brush. He's too cute. And hat. Simple names. <laughs> and how about we stick our little brushy inside the box. So, so tiny. These also remind me of Barbie accessories. So little. Whoa, and this one is a blast from the past. I don't think I've opened a season two in a couple months. Really long time. I miss them so, so much. I love season one, that was my favorite. I think season three is my second, but I also love two. They had the cutest and most classic characters. Oop, and I miss these little baskets too. So we have our two blind bags, collector's guide. See, what are we gonna get here? Ooh. Back in season two, they had a homewares department, and this is an iron. How funny is this? Goes by the name of Sizzles. I don't know though, it looks kind of strange because I don't remember Sizzles ever being like a neon orange and blue. 
You guys, I think these may be fake Shopkins. I don't know, I just have the feeling. And I'm looking at this list here, it looks kind of strange. Doesn't look like the authentic one. Oh, how did that happen? Let's open the other one, see what we have. Ah! From the shoe department, I, these are definitely fakes. They are not real. First of all, I think this is supposed to be heels. I don't think it was ever in this yellow color. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know who this is supposed to be. You can leave me a comment. Oh. So after opening up that blind basket, it is pretty clear that these are not real. These are definitely fake Shopkins. Ew, how did that happen? I don't know, they're the weirdest colors. They even feel kind of strange, not like the real ones. Ugh, don't like them. Enough with the fake Shopkins. Oh, I cannot believe I got those. We are on to the mini Kiss It Painted set. Look at this, they call it Kiss It Painted because it's got lip gloss, nail polish, but more than anything, I bought this because of this sparkly little bag. I thought I could like use it as a coin purse or a little wallet when I go to Disney. Open it. Here it is. Ooh, it's even prettier out of the box. I've been waiting to open this, this sparkly mini purse. You can put in the lip glosses and nail polish, but I think I'm gonna use this as like a little wallet and coin purse. So cute for going to Disney World. I love to go there. It's got Daisy and Minnie, and it doesn't have those glitter pieces that fly everywhere. It's covered in like a plastic coating, because sometimes these glittery things make a huge mess. And this one is perfect. It's not gonna do that. We get two polishes. This color looks so, so cool. Kind of like a neon blue. I hope it looks as good as it does in the bottle. And we get a mini and a daisy. I just love how they put a blue and a purple in there. They look really sparkly and I am just loving the handle. Look how cute she looks. So cute for a little nail polish collection. Can't go without my lip gloss and we got it. Here we go. We have mini purple. Ooh, it is grape flavored. Look at that picture on there. I just love anything that is Minnie Mouse. Cutest little face ever. Ooh, it takes a little while. There it goes. Always with these tubes, the clear comes out first. I don't know why. Mm, really, really good. So sparkly, really thick. Would fit in that little purse perfectly. And for Miss Daisy, I don't know. This really looks like a cuter color than the light purple. It's orange, but it may look pretty on your lips. And it's bubblegum. Ooh, bubblegum. I thought it was going to be orange flavored. <laughs> that was a surprise. Okay, here we go. Ooh. There's the orange. It's got a lot of shimmer in there. Mm, this one smells really good, too. It smells almost identical to the grape. You can't really tell a difference in the scents, but there's definitely a difference in the colors. I like them both. And of course, we gotta test out these polishes. So curious if this is gonna be dark or light. I think it's actually dark. Whoa, 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 look at this color, you guys. This is so, so beautiful. It's kind of glossy. Lots of these little sparkles in there. Such a pretty blue. I think I like these more than the Baby Baby one. So, so cute. And this one, the mini, is kind of like a light lavender. That one's really pretty too. So there's the purple, the mini one. This is really gorgeous too, but not as nice as that blue. I don't wear blue nail polish all the time, but with this one, I definitely want to wear it. Really, really glossy and shiny. Not too dark, not too light. And there is the whole mini Daisy crew together, the whole set out of everything. Of course, my favorite is this little pouch. Second is this blue polish, and you guys can leave me a comment and let me know out of all this stuff, what was your fave? Woo, that was a lot of makeup, and we did it. We looked at all of these sets. My favorite favorite was the Claire's one, just because it was so big, had so many things. I love those little Beanie Boos nail polishes. Just wish they were a little bigger. The mini case was so cute, and those nail polishes, lip gloss. Only thing I really didn't like were these fake shop pins. How did I get them? I don't even know where they came from. We are gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the show. This is Bubble Pop Kids. 
you can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day. Bye.